clotting process starts after the wall of the blood vessel is breached. The vessel constricts to reduce blood flow, and the platelets assemble at the damaged site. Though the platelets stop the bleeding at this stage, they are easily dislodged, and the bleeding can resume. As the platelets arrive, molecules released from the damaged vessel activate clotting factor 12. Factor 12 then activates another clotting protein, the factor 11. By closely fitting into the it, like lock key mechanism, once factor 11 is activated, it activates the next molecule, factor 9, with the same lock and key mechanism. This initiates a cascade of reactions that ends when the last molecule, thrombin is activated. Activated thrombin then snips small pieces off another protein called fibrinogen. When lots of fibrinogen is cut, the prune molecules cover the platelets and stabilize the clot. To form a stable clot, all the molecules in the cascade must be present and properly shaped.